I think all the adversities that I faced in order to pursue kickboxing really didn't discourage me. The fact is, the harder it was, I felt like I have to prove myself even more. So I feel like I've tried uh, harder in order to prove to everyone that a woman can also be as successful as the man. Because there's more women involved in the sport, uh, especially the combat sports, I feel there's a good change happening. So I don't feel that sexist attitude as much anymore, where I, at the beginning when I started, especially because I was coming from a Muslim country, I felt it more often. Uh, I feel like uh, the world is opening their eyes to females in the combat sports. The hardest thing for me as an athlete from Iran um, was facing the country not being so much on my side. Uh, having the men always uh, being first, having the better chances, having more opportunities to compete, and yet the women always having to be on the sidelines. Um, if there's a chance, maybe out of four men, one woman can attend. That, that was always the hardest thing for me because I felt like it wasn't fair. Um, but you know, you, we, we just have a few chances in life and I felt like I have to keep fighting for my chance so it'll happen. Before winning the world championships, I always wanted to be the blue corner because all of my losses were uh, in the red corner. But then I was at the top of the table, so I was in the red corner the whole uh, championship and I won it, I won gold, so that was my last superstitious idea. I, I tried to stop that and only worry about positive things. But my ritual is definitely um, listening to my favorite music, going into the zone, imagining my hand being raised and uh, focusing on technique, not so much um, the beating part, but mostly showing the world what a female athlete is capable of showing to the world. The reason I agreed to become an ambassador for the World Partnership Walk uh, was because, first of all, it was created originally by two immigrant women. And I'm an immigrant myself. And I feel like a organization that puts the effort and the energy and the funds um, to help women learn a skill or learn a trade in order to be independent and help their families is what I'm about. And I want to support that foundation. My biggest fear in life is not being able to use the success that I have now in a positive way. I feel like winning and losing is not something that I'm scared of. My only worry is I, I cannot show the world that you can use something that you have achieved in order to help others. And this is the way to um, be eternal. I'd say everyone faces adversities and it's important for us to stay focused on the goal. Not necessarily the ultimate goal, which is very big and so far away, but it's important to have a small goal. Every morning when you wake up, set up a goal for yourself. Don't worry about what others think. Don't worry about if someone doesn't believe in you. Believe in yourself and push yourself to your limits. And the next day, push yourself one step more. And this way you'll reach your goals.